Congratulations, Rudolf Diesel. The engine you invented in 1893 has come a long way. No longer sooty, clattering workhorses, today's diesel engines are quiet, durable, and cleaner than ever. They're also around 30% more fuel efficient than comparable gasoline engines, yet deliver much more torque and power. But with these improvements came compromises. To run their higher combustion pressures, conventional diesels need heavy industrial strength parts that sap driving performance. And cleaning up their nitrogen oxide emissions often requires costly after treatment systems. So we saw a big opportunity to create more torque, better fuel economy, less weight, and lower emissions. First, we defied convention by dropping the compression ratio to the lowest in the world for a diesel, 14 to 1. This delays combustion by just half a millisecond, which is enough time for the air and fuel to mix more thoroughly, reducing hot spots of oxygen and fuel that would otherwise turn into pollutants. Bingo. Our combustion is so clean that we meet the toughest emission standards without an expensive nitrogen oxide after-treatment system. And while low compression would normally mean a loss of efficiency, we actually improved it because our clean slate approach allows us to optimize the combustion timing, which gives us a longer effective expansion stroke. Another challenge with low compression diesels is getting ignition going when the engine isn't warmed up. So we use ultra-high pressure piezo fuel injectors that are so fast and powerful, they create a rich air fuel mixture that's easier to ignite. Then a patented variable valve lift system recycles hot exhaust gases back into the combustion chamber to quickly warm up the engine. Best of all, our engine's low compression ratio doesn't require the usual heavy industrial grade parts. As a result, the engine's weight was slashed by 10% using a lighter crank and pistons and an aluminum block rather than cast iron. This allows us to build lighter, more balanced vehicles with much better handling. Mechanical friction was also decreased, resulting in lower fuel consumption and an exceptionally high redline of 5200 RPM. When we were done, we had created a beast with much more torque at low and high speeds, yet 20% lower fuel consumption than its predecessor. The Skyactiv-D 2.2 liter twin turbo diesel delivers the driving performance of a four liter V8, the cleanliness of the latest clean gasoline engines, and the fuel economy of a hybrid. With such dramatic improvements, Mr. Diesel himself might not recognize it, but no doubt he'd love to drive it. Skyactiv technology from Mazda, the future of driving, begins now. We build Mazdas. What do you drive?